back to Key Talk Media. This is your host, Key Talk. Check it out, man. All right. I'm going to give a shout out to the notification gang, Key Talk gang. Give it a really the same thing for rocking with me every single video. If you listen to my voice right now, go ahead and like the video and hit the notification so you get a notification every single time I drop a video. Anyways. So if it's one thing that Finesse 2 Federal, Finesse 2 Tom's going to do, but he's going to get him some type of jewelry that's going to have, you know, that's going to go viral and have a lot of people talking. Now, the last thing he got was a, coo- a KKK, pretty much a chain with them on it. Well, it wasn't even a KKK. It was just like a chain with, you know, hooded men representing of the KKK actually hanging from a tree branch. And he pretty much said that he got that piece of jewelry because they hung up. So now every time he walks into an office doing a meeting or anything like that, you know, talking about depending on who he's with, no matter who he's with, he's going to be wearing it, and he's going to have that representation on his body, and, and now, it looks like, you know, to my finesse to federal, done got himself inside of some handcuffs, but it was not the type of handcuffs showing the buddy's about to go to jail, it's actually two handcuffs, he got a handcuff on one arm, and a handcuff on the other wrist, pretty much, and what those handcuffs are representation of, because the chain on the handcuffs is broken, he said that the reason he got these handcuffs was to represent and show freedom. We're going to take post. You represent freedom. I'm back, bro. Broke the time. Broke the time. Broke the time. I'm back. Nigga, you know, Finesse Two Times took this Instagram to explain it, and he said, when they closed Atlanta USP down, they shipped me to Berlin. New Hampshire had me on the bus 29 hours. When we got to the jail, I looked down and seen whelps on my wrist. I said in my mind, it's all right. When I get out, I'm going to bust these muck down. These muck represent freedom. Free all the real ones. Give the other ones lethal injection. Anyways, so of course, a lot of people in the comment section had they different thoughts on it. You know, talking about, of course, a lot of black people's like, nah, man, nah, I see cuffs, and I'm just like, nah, I'm out of here. But uh, you know, I'm talking about, if you think about history and stuff, though, uh, I believe that whenever the United States was gist- gifted the Lady of Liberty, I guess the Statue of Liberty, I believe, is inside of New York or somewhere, it's somewhere. Y'all know where it's at. Anyways, if you actually look at the bottom of the Statue of Liberty, she actually has on cuffs on her on her ankles with actually a broken chain as well. And that's said to also represent some type of freedom. You know what I'm talking about? So, you know what I'm talking about? However, he decides to do whatever he decides to get and whatever he says they represent and it means to him, of course, you know what I'm talking about? Go ahead and do it because you know what I'm talking about? what's for you is for you. Everybody ain't supposed to understand exactly what you got going on, anyways. How do y'all feel about it though? Do y'all feel like Putty's out of line for getting this, or do y'all feel like, hey, that's actually pretty dope that he got that? You know what I'm talking about? The representation of it, you know what I'm talking about? The broken cuffs, the broken chains, you know what I'm talking about? Anyway. Let me know some. Comment down below. Let me know what you think about this entire deal. I'm out.